The next concept is tube of flow. The number of finite elements of the streamline flows which are grouped together as a bundle that is called tube of flow. So the definition is the number of finite streamline flow elements those are grouped together as a bundle is called a tube of flow the general picture of the tube of flow is like this it is the tube of finite dimensions this is So inside this tube, we should assume many number of finite elements of the streamline flow. So it's like this. This is A, B. C, D, E. This A, B, C, D, E which was mentioned in this diagram are streamline flows. So streamline flow elements. Let us mention this tube also as T. So this T is called tube of the streamline flows. The next con concept is turbulent flow. Streamline flow, tube flow, turbulent flow. These are the different types of motion of a fluid. A fluid can move in these three types of motions. So turbulent flow, it is a simple unsteady flow which is unpredictable. This flow is unsteady. Un unpredictable. Floods are the best examples for the turbulent flow. So in this case of turbulent flow, lot of eddy currents will be produced by the each molecule of the water. These eddy currents absorb more amount of energy. And one more thing we should know that in this case of turbulent flow, the frictional force ex experienced by the each molecule is almost much greater than the streamline flow elements. So, the eddy currents in the turbulent flow absorbs more energy. The frictional force due to this turbulent flow elements is greater than the streamlined flow elements.
So these are the three points which are basically the separation between the turbulent, turbulent flow and the streamlined flow. Now we will discuss the differences and distinguishes between the turbulent flow and streamline flow. Now we will see the differences between the streamline flow and turbulent flow. There are three major differences. After that we will go to the critical velocity and Reynolds number. And those two are also differences between the streamline and turbulent flow. The first point in the difference is the velocities of each and every element of the fluid is constant throughout the motion in case of streamline flow. The velocity of the fluid element at each and every point is constant. But in case of turbulent flow, the velocity of the fluid elements is always varies with time. The velocity of the fluid element at each and every point varies with time. Streamline flow, the all flows will be linear. The path of the fluid is linear in case of streamline flow. But in case of turbulent flow, the path is undefined. The path of flow is undefined or random. Randomness means there is no particular direction to move. That is the biggest problem in case of turbulent flow. The third point is in streamline flow there is no chance for the eddies and vertices. No chance for the eddy currents and vertices. The turbulent flow is an alternative combination of eddies and vertices. It is the combination of eddies and vertices. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.